Today we're going to make hummus. This has been a challenge for me for years. I've tried to make a good tasting hummus without using so much oil. And I have found it really difficult, but I think I found a good recipe here and I hope you like it too. Um, we're just going to start with, I've got a, this is worth two cans worth of chickpeas and I've already poured out about half of the liquid. You want to save about half the liquid. So we're just going to pour that in. Half a cup of cashews. That's going to give it a nice creamy texture. Some nutritional yeast. And this, um, when you become nutritarian or even just vegan, uh, people get really concerned about um, vitamin B12, that you may become deficient in vitamin B12 because it's really hard to get. Uh, but nutritional yeast has vitamin B12. So we're going to use some of that. Some garlic. About a tablespoon of rags, maybe a little less. Lemon juice. And tahini. I use about a quarter of a cup, maybe just a little bit less than a quarter of a cup. So more like three or four tablespoons. We're just going to whiz it up till it's nice and creamy. You might have to do this two or three times. It just depends on the strength of your blender. This is a pretty high speed blender, so it can pretty much do it in one, one step. Let's try and see if it's smooth. Mm. Mm. It's perfect. I'm just going to scoop a little out here. And hummus, I mean, you can use this for anything. I'm sure you all know, you know, you can use it as a spread on a sandwich or you can use it as a snack with carrots and celery or any, any vegetable really. Love it. I hope you like it too.